Greetings and welcome back to, I think, episode 5 of Terraria with myself and the Metasapia. Hello everyone! Now, we finally had some time to actually see some of the comments that people have been leaving. This is the first episode that we've been recording since we started uploading the series, and there are a number of things that we are going to be addressing at the very beginning of this episode. Take it away, let's say, Pierre. Yeah, first of all, a lot of people have been concerned that uh, we're not going to get far or enjoy this because we set the difficulty a bit high. Um, and that's uh, this being my first time playing this, uh, I'm not going to enjoy this at all. Don't worry about that. Uh, I enjoy having a decent challenge in my games, so I'm probably going to enjoy this even if we die quite a bit. Uh, so that will make things much better once you actually accomplish something, in uh, my opinion, in these kinds of games. I'll just flat out enjoy dying. I'm weird. Yeah. Dwarf Fortress has trained me well. There have been uh, quite a few interesting deaths as well. So, uh, yeah, that's good. Quite a also, few dirty got, deaths. Uh, got a lot of tips on what to do with weapons and such. So we're going to start off by making a few things in Indeed. this episode. Now, quite a lot of people were commenting on broadswords specifically and why I hadn't uh, made one myself. I was simply waiting for some better uh, metal to make some, honestly. Uh, generally speaking, I, I don't mind just fighting through having a short sword until I can make a, a, a silver or equivalent broadsword. But one thing that I wasn't aware of was that wooden broadswords had a comparable, or in many cases, better damage than the copper short sword so at the very minimal i should have i should have been making some of that but uh we do now have quite a lot of resources metasapia is currently checking out i think we have 25 gold now yes. my recommendation for that metasapia would be for you to make a golden pickaxe as i yes, mentioned so i've got a tungsten one so the next upgrade would be for yours but a gold one is very important because it would allow us to access some ores that the tongue someone flat out can't mine. So now we have a golden pickaxe. There should also be enough left for you to make a golden one if you want one as well. Really? How much do they use? 12 for one. We now have 13 left. Oh, wow. You want Fantastic. One? Yeah, I'll, I'll uh, upgrade. I was expecting it to take a lot more than that. Yeah, apparently it wasn't that much. And we found a lot of gold last time. So now we have a bunch. I also, wonder. we should probably make some broadswords with that in mind. Yes, I hadn't even absolutely. thought about that because I was using the bow and the yo-yo so much and just ignoring the sword. Uh, but yeah, we it's probably have a good idea. got enough tungsten to make two tungsten broadswords, so... Nice. Uh, should we make something else, though? Because we've got enough to make a lead broadsword, which is 11 melee damage. The tungsten is 12. The tungsten, well, armor is actually really expensive. We haven't got enough tungsten to really do much in terms of armor. But it How does much lead add do we have? 51. All right, so, so we can get two pieces of armor out of the lead, at the very, very least. Yeah. So I think we should probably go for that. Also, yeah, I'm going to make uh, a tungsten broadsword. Pop that there. And I'm also going to make a piece of white string, and I recommend you do the same. All right. And then pop it in your inventory, so, uh, into your accessory slot, because it'll increase the range of your yo-yo. Yeah. And you can have a look at what else you want to make then. Right. So uh, we're going to um, a tungsten broadsword. Yep. Uh, there we go. So. N now we should have uh, pretty decent weapons. Yeah. It'll be a so, lot easier to deal with some of the uh, tougher mobs that we were finding down in the caves at the very least. Right. I need the... There we go. White string. Oops, I've got a gold bar on me still. Nice it was a there. rush white string. Plus 2% melee speed. Very oh, nice. nice. I just got a regular one. <clears throat> Alright, and I think I have enough arrows for now. Don't need that. Anything else we should make? Uh, armor, you said? Yeah, 
definitely have a look at making the armor. Uh, whilst armor. you're working on that, I'm going to actually start excavating a little place to make a new uh, building. One specifically Crap. for the merchant, I think. So, uh, have enough for a helmet for each of us. Okay. Or a helmet and boots. Not enough for uh, two pieces if we make the chain mail. So what do you want to do? Um, if you want to make whatever pieces of gear you want, then I'll have a quick gander through and see what I can put together from what's left. Alright, so I can make the lead helmet and boots then. Yep, by all means. Right. Um, I might need more armor, I don't know, but... Uh, of the two of us, since I can die a lot. I but, don't know. Uh, you have some crazy mad surviving skills, I've noticed. Uh, no. <laughs> like, you're like, no, I deny this. Um, you are, in fact, just, mistaken. Should we use the chest upstairs for um, just leftover gear and stuff? Yeah, anything that isn't material, I'm putting in the chest upstairs. Right. Is the general way that I'm uh, working it at the moment. So now we have a yeah. decent uh, amount of stuff. Yep. Is that your, um, you put your tungsten pickaxe in there or is that yeah. a... Yeah. Because mm -hmm. you made a gold one, that's right. Yep. Forgot right away. Sorry. Well, that's okay. Uh, could make a tungsten axe, but I don't actually think there's particularly any need to have a tungsten axe to be honest with you. Uh, let's see. Uh, we've got lead fence. I'm not sure if that goes behind or in front of something. I guess we could have a look at that because that would be actually quite nice for the graveyard, I think. Yeah. Do you need a better axe for uh, stuff? No, no, there's, there's no tree that I'm aware of, at the very least, that uh, requires an axe of a certain type to cut down. There might be some things later on, but uh, I've, I'm certainly not aware of them if there are. If uh, there's something new, feel free to uh, comment and uh, tell us how wrong we are. Yeah, indeed. Right, let's get myself a bunch of arrows. I've got a crazy amount of arrows now. I don't even have a bow yet. But you do have a bow. Yeah. So I'll probably just stay back and loot them off your corpse if you should die. Thanks. Thanks. I'm, I'm glad that I can be of service, I guess. Also, we uh, took the many, many words of advice and put the money in chests. Yep. So don't you worry about that anymore. You should still worry, but it's yeah, not but... as useful. We're not going to lose as much money this time yeah. around. Right, I'm making a bunch of fire arrows for you. Right. I just have a bunch of regular ones. I'm also trying to get used to making... Uh, to favoriting things in my inventory. Right, I'm going to make a tungsten bow for myself. That there sounds go. good. Is there more left for uh, more tungsten stuff? Or more uh, I don't bows? think so, no. We've because I just have, right uh, have the wooden one still. Well, since I'm... Well, there's enough for a copper bow. Alright, I can Thing. make one of those, I guess. But what I'll do... The... I'll, I'll make the copper bow since uh, you're going more of an archery. Oh, damn it. Let me uh, just drop that on the floor. Uh, you can take it if you want to. No, there we are. And then All a right. bunch of arrows as well. Oops. Do you need two stars to make something out of them? No, three stars, I'm afraid. Okay. There may be some uh, other things that you can make. At least not one star. Yeah. There may be some other things that you can make with it. Uh, it's unfortunately, an I can't annoying just drop those now. Bow. Well, I can't help that. I'm sorry, but... Oh, well, let's see. I'll compare them. I've also put minutes. a bunch of flame arrows in the golden chest that's down below. Wow. Minus 20% damage, minus 15% speed. Oh, uh, I make the best bows. It's true facts. It has a better 
damage than my uh, original one, but otherwise it's worse. Less crit chance, less damage boost. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I didn't even look at the modifiers on it. Oh well. There is a, there's, a golden there's a bunch of flame arrows in the golden chest just below you. Right. And I'm going to be crazy and I'm going to open this door as soon as you're ready. And we need to try and kill all of these things that are going to try and walk in. Alright. I'll okay. just get my yo-yo at the ready. Ready? Ready. This I'm just going to so try beautiful. and set them on fire. Ah. Oh dear. There's a demon eye in the basement. There is. There is a zombie coming towards the guide. Yes. There we go. He's a little bit slow, um, but uh, he works hard for stuff. Right, I need to have a look. What kind of stone have we got? We haven't actually got much stone of any type, which is a bit of a shame. That is the next thing I want to work on, is building up the merchants here. We've got enough gold that we should be able to summon the merchant. All right. Get out of it, you scallywags, you. Power also, of the we just have uh, lots of zombies down in the area you're trying to build. That's fine. It's something. It's target practice, basically. Yeah, I got some decent stuff from them. A little bit of money. Not too much stuff, but oh come on! <laughs> I'm managing to miss it with this wand constantly. It's rather embarrassing. But star. there is a star over there. Oh, we should probably close the door so the guy doesn't get eaten in our absence. That might be a good idea. All right, so what do you want to do today? Well, I'm mostly wanting to focus on building up the merchant's abode. So we're going to need a lot of stone. So why don't we go back down into the cave and start gathering resources? That way to do. We can just work oh, on it. the areas we that have was, down oh, there man. already. There we go. Is that really the best no, weapon to use? It is absolutely not, but it's fun. It's, that, which it's is not why doing, I'm doing much it. at all. Oh, come on, it's setting them on fire. Ouch! Oh, okay. I take it back. You can get it. Uh, that put me from there. Very well. There we go. Did you make the uh, string? Yes. Fantastic. So now we should be able Got to. Got a very long range on our yo yo's. Do these and stuff. Ah, I really missed the double jump. Yeah. Well, uh, there is a little bit of stone over here, but we may as well go a little bit deeper. Since it's a bit yeah, more interesting. Yeah, we might be able to find stuff uh, down there. Also, I'm aware that I have passed by some gems over there. I don't remember where they are, but. Oh, okay. I noticed that in editing. So sorry if uh, anyone got really upset about that. Oh, if they're going to get upset about us missing gems, then this probably isn't the best let's play for them to be watching. No, we're going to miss a lot of stuff. Be warned. Oh, come on. I could probably also, use bombs. I should, should, should avoid dying. Probably. Yes. Probably. I... <laughs> wow. <laughs> that thing that is worm? really messing you up. That worm also, is really how to get me. A lot of people wanted us to join the same team. There we go. Oh, right. That we should so, uh, do. Green that'll team. help a little bit. Yeah, green team is the best team. There we go. All right, I am it going to... It was mostly to... the yellow slime that was messing up. Oh, right, okay. I was trying to avoid the worm and jumped right into a slime and tried to fight the slime, but it didn't go well. Oh. Well, that's just fine. Just going to hang we can make a bit, bit of a uh, fast track route down here if we want. Yeah. Also, there's a lot of stone to get here, so we can just mine out a lot of it. Should probably drop down a couple of uh, platforms as we go, though. Now oh, let's just fall to our dooms. I'd rather not. Of all the things that I could be spending my time doing, falling to my doom, not high on the list. Really? Yeah, it's such as a it nice happens. priority. No. Maybe with crazy uh, masochistic mentis apiers, yes, but... No, I just mean watching people fall. 
Oh, I see. You, you don't actually want to fool yourself. You just want to watch me do it. I, I get you. I did so in love with Bit of a nice, easier path down here. Then having to go all the way down, then all the way back up. Right. Now, one of the other reasons why I would really like to get a merchant quickly is so that we can get a bug net. Yeah. That is going to be very useful for us. Wow. Green mushroom, really? Hmm. I wonder what that's hmm. useful. I have no idea. But yeah, I'm not going to really say those gems. There's just one tiny just little, tiny little cluster of gems. Wow. That is an unfortunate place to be, jellyfish. I must confess. You are rather boned in there. There we go. Ah. This is going to flood a little bit, though, unfortunately. That's fine. I'm just going up after it. Can we actually see anything down there? I'm going to pop my uh, potions since I've got so many of them. Uh, there's something right down at the bottom here that we can try and get to. This might be a bad idea. What's wrong? Uh, sand. Ah, uh, right, yeah. I'll just leave that there. I can probably get a lot more of it, but yeah. Also, um, I think there was a big cave thing. No, not a big cave, but a cave below the house. Okay, I'll uh, try and dig in that direction. Let me just drop down a torch down here, though. Ooh. Actually, I wouldn't mind just getting up there if I can. There we go. Right, so we have this ore thing here. Can we get that now? Uh, yeah, you can. With your, actually, yeah, both of us can. Come to think of it. Well, I got it. There we go. What do we make with that? Some of the much better tier gear, but we're also going to need to have killed some of the bosses in order to get some. Uh, of the components. For us, it'll be Brain of Cthulhu. So if it right. were, ooh, water. Uh, well, I guess it doesn't matter too much. Let's uh, strain this out. I really love the, the animation of it now. The way it drains water. Damn it. Oh, it's a little bit high. <laughs> yes. Or a rope coil, which is my personal preference. All right. Now I just like both. using rope. Ooh, gold. You can always get more gold. There's so much gold around here. Yeah, which is very, very nice. If we can get up to gold tier armor, that is going to put us in a very good position. Though it's obviously going to take a stupid amount to get. Yeah. Um, armor pieces tend to cost an awful lot. I would expect it to, because you have to... Um get so or use so much to cover up your entire body but uh do you there. see anything no nothing at all okay we're going down this way i would say oh dear we use your flare guns anything. yeah that's far oh man we've got rope lots and lots of rope Ah, I didn't put the star in the box. Oh, skeletons. Let's put some torches down, I think. Whoop. There we go. That Whoop right it. there is a blink root, I believe. Oh, damn it. Come back, rope. Where? Uh, I just picked up the In blink the water root. there? No, no, no. It was, it was just beside it. I just picked it up. It's basically a, a little plant. It's kind of useful. Oh, What's over here? here? Nothing at all. Not too bad. I really, really like this. Ooh, heart container. Now, this is one thing that I had no idea about, but quite a few people have suggested using that heart container. And, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. That was not a good time oh, for me. Oh no. Haha, -ha, I'm still kind of safe. Oh. Drat. You can't touch them when they're electric? No. Can you use yo-yo? I have no idea. Go away. Thank you very much. It seems like you a bad guys. idea to use fire arrows in water, but it worked. Yeah, surprisingly well. There we go. Phew. Okay. Go. Now, 
I was told to make use of the heart container for... Can I build that out there? Oh, I can I can build straight off the rope. That's awesome. For making a heart... Um, a heart lantern. Now, that's All something right. I've not, not seen before. But apparently it gives a really good regeneration boost when you're stood in its light. Right, so it's uh, an item you place, not an accessory yeah. or something. You yeah. take it then. Ooh... What have you found? Um, this must be the water chest I've heard about. Ooh. Very nice find. Uh, I just need to drain out this jellyfish. Can you not access the chest through? Ooh, I can actually. Feather fall potion. Shows falling speed. Okay, and look. suspicious looking eye. Haha! <laughs> okay, well that will allow us to summon the eye of Cthulhu. If Reading we were crazy. Read, I'll take that. I think uh, it's not probably it's not. let this water out. Hang on, is that not uh, necessary? Breathing reed. It doesn't say equipable. No, if you put it in your hotbar, there. See, you right. breathe now from where the the top of the breathing reed is. So if that's in water, you'll drown. All right. But if it isn't, you're okay. Just wow, this arrow. is a big lake. I had no idea. This, this is part of the fun of just randomly draining large bodies of water. You never know how much water you're going to drain. Right. I'll just take everything. Sure. And we now have the eye. There's a lot of water in there. It goes yes. over and around. Yep. Just put the torch in there. Well, I'm pretty proud of myself. I don't care what anyone else says. This is awesome. Now, Jellyfish, you may leave the room. Or you may just stay up there, but... Uh... All right. There we go. The whole thing has been drained now. Try to do it. Really? Right. Jellyfish was just standing in my oil and not getting hit. I don't think the Jellyfish stands. It has no legs. Fine. <laughs> there wasn't much to say to that except an exasperation sigh. Yes, I, I appreciate that that was a terrible thing to say. There we go. All right. Uh, okay. I'm going to shoot it. Okay. Maybe. Then... Pick up the water chest. That'll be a nice hole. Also, oh, well, Piranha down there. I think we need to uh, find another way out. No, we're good. I mean, when we get up again. Oh, right. Ah, yes. Because <laughs> now there's a lot of water down there. Also, Worm. some sapphires. Oh! Oh, no! Really? Of all the places for a trap to be, it <laughs> had to be there. Just disappearing downhill. Uh, it's not on mine, but uh, that was rather unfortunate, to be to be sure. I seem to have a knack for finding terrible, terrible things. Yep. Well, better me than you, I suppose. At least, oh, no, at no, least no, one no, of us survived. No, 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 no. Oh dear. Alex's skull was crushed by a boulder. Yes. Unfortunately, it was a beautiful Can skull, he... and then it was crushed. Whoosh. Yeah. Fleeing it's from beautiful. piranhas. Ah, there we go. There we I go. am back. All right, go and get your stuff that's up there. Okay. Because uh, I can't hold all of that. And then I'm going to just arrange your stuff. All and right. 90% uh, of this uh, collab has been Metasapia putting my stuff in a chest. And me draining lakes. Okay, right. All of my gear is back where it should be, and for the looks of it, there's a little bit more, more exploring we could do. Yep. Okay, that's Nothing looks down interesting. There. Let's see up there. Oh, there's other stuff. It goes stuff. up, okay. But there's stuff right up there where I unfortunately got slain from. Do you uh, have uh, more roll coils? Yep, lots more. I just have plain rope. I should probably make some into coils. Yeah, it's fairly cheap to do. 
definitely useful. Is that gold oh, there down we there? Go. Yes, it is. Perfect. Ah, damn it. I just broke the torch I placed. It might have been me as well. See anything in there? Uh, just the gold, really. Yeah. Okay. Well, I think that makes for the beginnings of an interesting spelunk. But uh, at this point, I think we're probably going to wrap up the episode there. Yes. Whilst uh, I mine out this copper vein that everyone is saying I should oh, just no, ignore no, 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 because no, no, no. it's pointless. I refuse. It's copper, man. We can use it for all types of things like boilers and pipes. We can't actually do either of those things. But in my mind, we can. But that is going to be the end of this episode. So thank you very much for joining us. And I hope we will see you in the next. But until then, and as always, do take care. See you.